Yeah, so it's a crazy, crazy world, y'all. I hope y'all been. Hold on real quick. All right, get some of that good old, good old, good old cocoa butter. Yeah, man, I hope y'all been really taking care of y'all selves for real, because one thing I'm going to tell you, just that coat, y'all don't only use one type of everything. Yeah, my shorty got me some of this. Whoa! That's for Persian and Greek skin only. Nigga, I took my DNA test, bitch. I know what my I know who my mother is and my father is. Some of y'all niggas don't even know who y'all parents are. You get it? Like it's about making a family bloodline. Like I told you. Stop texting these bitches first. You know why? Because the whole time you liking them, they not telling you they like you like you better, like you more. Like, stop playing with these hoes. Like I said, all this shit fake. Why the fuck you think I ain't even make a video about Chris Rock and Will Smith? I knew y'all was gonna figure that one out. I, I said, if these niggas don't see the scene from the Nutty Professor, when Eddie Murphy went up there and flipped David Chappelle over the show, that was, who was sitting in the seat right there? Wasn't that Jada Pinkett? All right. Chris Rock, Jada Pinkett, all of them, they friends. That was to wake y'all up. Why the fuck you think you see uh, Jada Pinkett in The Matrix? The movie The Matrix. Why you think she was in there? And uh, speaking of that, her hair was like this when she was in there. Her hair was long as fuck in that movie. But this what I'm. This what y'all gotta understand. All this shit fake. You ain't see the three pyramids with Osiris, mummy in the background on the Oscars. Nigga, they ain't have nobody in the crowd. Why the fuck you think niggas is getting smacked in there? Listen. You know how easy it is? Them niggas went to school for years, nigga. Do you understand what Hollywood is? Nigga. Nigga, I'm related. Listen, let me tell you something. I'm related to one of the bitches who made witchcraft. No disrespect to her name. Listen, my family. I'm related to Cleopatra. I'm related, I'm related to Nefertiti. Do you understand me? I'm related to them. I am Greek and Persian. I'm straight African. 100% African, nigga. 100%. I'm 30, 30% Benin. Do you know what Benin is? Benin is the country that Voodoo was made in. So when the ratings of the Oscars drop so low and niggas ain't buying tickets, do you get it, stupid? Now... Like I said, they coming up with some shit where they going to live longer. You hear me? Check on that metaverse shit. But not only that, I'm talking about these children, these angels that's coming down to the earth. They're about to crack the code to the matrix. Real shit. Them niggas is about... If you take care of yourself and you be a, a vegan right now, right... If you taking care of yourself and you being a vegan right now, when your ass get like 90 or 70 or 80, they're going to already have antidotes to push y'all niggas to 175. Y'all going to be able to live for a long time. And not only that, after that, they trying to jump y'all consciousness into robots after that. So y'all niggas... They trying to make y'all be able to live forever, but that's, you know what I'm saying? That's pointless. You should want to, you should want to die at a hundred. You should. But like I said, though, y'all got to understand what's going on with y'all world. A lot of shit is happening. A lot of shit. Y'all don't see this earth vibrate. When you look at the news, all you seeing is they creating robots now. Like, I'm talking about with rubbery skin, AIs, they move and all of that. So, all y'all that's late waking up, like, I've been woke, before, I've been woke, 2013, I was woke, I, I woke up, I woke up, I found out where I was at, what was going on, who I was, man, damn, 
So like I said, when you see one actor go on stage and smack another one and nobody goes to jail. Because, I mean, that's supposed to be the Oscars. Like, you ain't even supposed to be in there swinging. You get what I'm That's not even the type of place where it's not the club or no. You know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, you ain't even supposed to be swinging at the club. But do you see what's going on with all of this fake shit? Like, if you ain't wake up from that, that smack. If you ain't wake up from that, that smack was meant to wake y'all up. It literally, like, when Will Smith smacked them, like, I could smack somebody hard but fake. You get what I'm saying? Like, you could make it look hard. Like, go watch wrestling. Y'all forgot about wrestling? You see how hard the niggas smack the shit out of each other? And y'all think that was real? <laughs> my nigga, the body movements. I, re, I could, my, my, my third eye, I could scan your body movements and know that shit was fake. That was just to get y'all niggas hyped up. Hyped up. They literally tested everybody's channel to see who made a video and thought it was real. So now they know how many people was actually woke and sleep. That's why me, I ain't even going, I'm not even going to put the uh, title on. You get it? Like, I could care less. Like, the people that I'm talking to right now, they know me for, you get it? Like, I'm not over here trying to spread my channel and get niggas hyped and all of that, nigga. These tarot card readers is angels, my nigga. Like, I'm trying to tell you. These tarot card readers is angels. I ain't do a psychic message in a long, in a, in a little minute. Like, probably a month and a half. But the point is, is people got demons in them. Do you understand me? People got demons in them. Like, y'all don't get it. Like, people be sitting right next to you and want to see you fail. Like, y'all didn't wake up to that point yet. So, of course, y'all going to still think Will Smith and all that shit real. Nigga, those is two actors. Did you see the scene from Nutty Professor? Just go look that shit up. Go look it up. Nutty Professor Part 1. Yeah, when he was driving in the coupe and he got fat and his fucking foot slammed on the gas and yeah, that one. Cause y'all be th y'all thought when I first came out with this page, I was trying to be funny. Now that y'all see all these other niggas woke TikTokers, let me tell you something about YouTube. Three people: Dorian, uh, the music group channel, right? NBA Young Boy, right? And Spiritual Soul. Nigga, I'm going to tell you niggas something about these niggas real quick. All right. Spiritual soul. This nigga used to get mad views. Every video used to get a mill automatically. Like when he was doing stuff that when he was in his lower self, when he was doing stuff like that, he was getting mad views like. Reacting to this, reacting to that. Like, me, I'm not the type of nigga that like to get on computers. and Like, I see everybody on YouTube on the side of the video reacting to somebody else's shit. Like, I I, I wasn't put on this earth to do that. I was put on this earth to save it. Risk the, um, raise the frequency of the planet. Like, I almost said risk the frequency of the planet. So, y'all, that's what I'm saying. Y'all got demonic spirits. Like, Really trying to attack y'all. But like I said, every video used to get a mill. Guess what happened when he, the nigga woke up and started waking y'all up? His fucking views went from 1.1 million to 1 million to 900K to 800,000 to 700,000 to 600,000. Oh, you keep fucking talking? You keep trying to wake your fucking followers up? 300,000. 200,000. Now the nigga can't get no more than 50, 250K views. Why? Because he's trying to help y'all niggas? Because he don't want y'all DNA to get fucked up? Because the shit that they call in junk DNA, that's not junk DNA. That's the shit that you unlock so you can actually see a ghost. See, y'all niggas be slow. Same thing with group 82. Now go look up his page. I'm not saying he's slow. I'm saying... He's smart because the nigga added up all his views. He had like 700 million. He, no, he had like 
17 mil, right? For the month or some shit, right? And I'm not scoping or pocket watching. I'm just peeping how YouTube treat different individuals. But like I said, if I had bitches twerking right now behind me, whole different story. You know what I'm saying? But that's need to hit. That's we don't even got to talk about that because some people go from a light transition to a dark transition. And this is what I'm going to tell y'all. I got to tell y'all about my actual coat, my own coat. Y'all niggas, y'all understand this, 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 a coat shit go back to when the pyramids was first built. Like y'all don't get that before the pyramids built, there was masons. There was Freemasons. There was, there was people who actually knew what the fuck was going on. Because in the jungle, them niggas been knew about what was going on way out there because they only had the simulation to run around in them trees they was running around in. Nigga, you could see the stars at night like it's nothing with no city lights. Y'all forgot the, the, the city lights is reflecting on the sky and not allowing y'all to see through. Why you think in California in the mountains you could fucking see a fucking whole computer screen? So like I said, the nigga Dorian's he got 17 million views. Nigga only got paid for a mill of them. Like, what the fuck? Only, uh, so basically, he only was able to get a million views worth of ads and commercials and shit. Oh, wow. All right, I see, I see what, I see what that's about. But why? Because he's telling y'all niggas to be independent because y'all gonna make so much more money and y'all not gonna have to get rid of y'all masters and now nba young boy they said this nigga ain't make a 25 cents off a, a fucking record since he's had a deal and i'm not the one who exposed that i ain't saying nothing about it. i'm just i just don't understand how people don't realize how strong he is you know how much money he could have had if he did not sign a deal my nigga that nigga would be giving out the deals right now. No bullshit. He would literally, that nigga be worth a billion dollars right now. You stupid. You know how many fucking views this nigga got? That nigga would be worth a billion dollars right now. Real shit. So, but me, I respect it though. You, let me tell you something why I, what I respect. Because when a label sign you, the label was thinking like, all right, I'm going to make this nigga a star for ever i'm not gonna see you can make yourself a star forever you give them that's that's not the problem but the point is is once they give y'all that money you gotta think a lot of money get wasted like beyond the, like when they give y'all that 250 that quarter mil or half a mil that shit turn into fucking fifty thousand by the next year that's you know not I'm talk, not talking about the way you spent it. I'm talking about the value. That's why they have to add interest on it. So y'all gotta understand with being with a label, they're gonna automatically blow you up way past the point that you you know what I'm saying? Like go from basically nothing to a star with a label. You know what I'm saying? So but I'd rather work my way up organically and just let people just start finding me thousands. Cause people just like you better. When they find you and you just a rapper. And you just doing your thing, you in and out the store, you smoking blunt, whatever. They like that shit because it's just more authentic. You get what I'm saying? Like, so it's just like you really get the best of both worlds, just being a, a rapper, just being an under, you know what I mean? Don't you don't got it. You could be in the mainstream too, but just do songs with niggas that's mainstream. But don't put yourself out there like that. You don't have to be on Instagram every day. Like, see me, I'm the type of nigga that you might not see me on Instagram for a year, nigga. Cause I'm so busy doing what i'm doing in my life i ain't got time to be on instagram for real like y'all 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 don't know how my life be nigga i got motherfucking businesses to feed and then the, on top of it the spiritual work y'all don't understand so like i said they making rubber faces in the lab so Do you get it? It's about that time where uh, everything is just like really falling apart. Like, so what you need to do is stay focused on you and 
this page right here, Kaladara, this is that that's it. Like, cause they people keep making fake pages. Like, why? Nigga, I don't even have a thousand subscribers that I that like I literally when I'm talking to y'all, I'm talking directly to y'all. I'm not talking to the rest of you. This is a whole different frequency, my nigga. Most of this information came from Kali Ma. So I'm giving her her credit. My name don't even need to be on the page. Really. But like I said, Sa is Persian. So that's just, that's why y'all could just call me Prince Sa when you see me on here. But I'm channeling spirit. Like, this is what I'm doing. Like, so if you could get the message and you actually understand what the fuck I'm saying, nigga. Like, I'm vegan. You don't see the skin is clear. Nigga, like, you don't see the baby hairs, the baby lining, nigga. Like, my skin clean. And I've been doing my Ramadan this month. So, oh, man, I mean, I do really, really eat like that every day. Like, I just don't eat during the day. But you see that sunflowers, they waxy too. I got them waxed up. So, I love y'all. I'm sending love and light. And I want all y'all to understand that this shit ain't as hard as you think it is. Like, it's not depressing. But I see that a lot of shit is going on in the news. Did y'all notice that? A lot of shit is going on. A lot. Believe me. People still getting... It's 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 crazy out there for y'all. It is. But um, I love y'all and... Like I said, don't worry about me, but y'all got more shit coming. Like, I see a lot of people waking up. And like I said, y'all about to have the antidote when y'all get about like 75, 80. That's why y'all don't need to act too crazy. Because if you still got shit to do with your wife, it's going to be living to like 150, 175. Like I said, y'all used to live longer than that, but... Tree of life got all fucked up. Y'all supposed to be living directly connected to the earth. And you would, your ass would be wanting to die. That's how long you'll be living. You'll be eating only off the trees and living on the land. You would be living like a ghost, nigga. But like I said, everybody got demons in them. So watch out. And this, this month, like I said, January, I saw a door with light going under it. That was, that was the picture. The next month, I saw a tiger. February, January, I saw a door with the light going under it. February, I saw a tiger on a chain, like a real, like a brolic ass tiger on a chain, ready to break off the chain. March, I saw, uh, I think I saw a dolphin, like jumping over. A, a boat or some shit. I think, yeah, that's what it was. It was like a dolphin or a dolphin jumping into the sky. I don't know. It was it was something like that. But this month, April, because all that shit, I should be I should have been writing them down. The visions of the month because they always help me. Like, but this month, I saw an egg like on Mario, like a little Yoshi type egg with a dinosaur cracking out. That's what I saw, like a dinosaur breaking out of an egg. So. Anybody who get this video, that's what you're doing. You're getting ready to be cracking out of your egg, like literally. So get ready to get it world what you got. You know what I'm saying? Handle your business and, you know, keep studying. Stay smart, you know? Like I said, when I do, when, like I said, you know what I'm saying? I, I, I follow God. I am work for 100% God. You know what I'm saying? I work for Kali Ma. I channel for Kali Ma. That's where I get my help with my psychic. I mean, God get, God unlocked my psychic abilities and my gifts. But Kali Ma helps me channel and find this information. So that's why I, I'm telling y'all who the fuck I get the information from. It's a spirit. Yeah. She's gone. She, I mean, well, she's going to y'all, but... When you tap in, she's not gone. She's, Kali Ma is still here. You know what I'm saying? So you could tap in and you could notice shit. 
You know what I'm saying? I, I tell you where I get my information from. I get my information from spirits. Like nobody that you know is teaching me what I know. Nobody. So, like I said, um, so just, just, you know, stay focused. Don't let nobody get to you. But I saw that baby dinosaur cracking out that egg and that's going to be you. So, you only you know what that means. So like I said, 